Welcome back everyone for another Naruto CCG video. I'm going to be opening up this Battle Boost booster box. It's a little different than the normal booster box videos you'll see because the booster packs are um, unique. And I'll explain in just a little bit. But this booster box I would assume you'd find at your local store with the flap open and uh, the booster packs inside. You could just buy booster packs for $2 as it says on the top. I paid a lot more for this box than $2, unfortunately, but uh, pretty unique. I, I, I think it's pretty cool. Here are the sides of the box. So I think there's like 25 packs inside, uh, but I threw in some other packs from some different sets. So I'll just uh, make my way through and uh, we'll see what we get. So let's take a closer look at the booster pack. Here is the cover art or the package art. And as you can see at the bottom, it says selected cards from series one through six. So the reason these booster packs are unique is because they only have five cards in them versus uh, your normal booster pack, which is gonna have 10 cards. So uh, half the cards, unfortunately. Um, and the other big thing is that the five cards are gonna be three common, one uncommon, and one surprise card, which means the surprise card could be an uncommon, a rare, or a gold foil or super rare. So basically um, a little bit less of a chance to actually get that um, super rare. Uh, and you might not even get a rare, it might just be a regular uncommon. So uh, a little unfortunate with, with these cards, but uh, I got a lot of them, so we'll see what happens. And then again, I have some other uh, booster packs at the bottom that we'll go through. So we'll just make our way through these starting with this one. So remember, these sets are going to be from the first six sets, which is Path to Hokage, Coils of the Snake, Curse of the Sand, Revenge and Rebirth, Dream Legacy, and Eternal Rivalry. So uh, all of these cards are going to be from those first six sets. So we'll see what we can get. All right. So starting off first pack. Our first card is going to be Tortoise Ninja. Next is Hizashi Huga. We have Slicing Sound Wave. Ino Yamanaka. Shadow Shurigen Jutsu. And those are the first five cards. So with that first pack, we had three common and then two uncommon. So no rares yet. Second pack. First card will be Kojai. Gontetsu. Gama. Lord of the Land of Wind. And Sand Cocoon. Third pack. We have Kotetsu. Dreadful Scars, our first rare, Haku, Cursed Fate, and Yashimaru. On to the fourth pack. So, so far we've gotten mostly uncommon and common. We've gotten one rare so far. Fourth pack, we have Challenging again, Kakashi Hatake. Well, how about that? A super rare. Gentle fist style, eight trigrams, 64 palms. Wow, I did not actually expect to get a super rare. That's awesome. Here's a closer look at the effect text. Really nice. And it's a, you can tell the super rare by the three white dots at the bottom. Very awesome. Put that off to the side real quick. We have walking on water training and reason for their highest renown. Our fifth pack, we have Kakashi Hatake, Ino Yamanaka, another rare fire style Phoenix Flower Jutsu, Sendayu Asama, and Akane. Onto our sixth pack, so for normal booster boxes, it's one in every six packs you have a chance to get a super rare. So 
right now we're uh we're hitting that mark so that's pretty awesome of course this is a little bit different but six pack we have kotetsu dreadful scars another rare silent killing jutsu coward and gato transport so three rares and one super rare so far next pack Ino Yamanaka, The Demon Brothers Gozu, Puppet Master Jutsu, Akamaru, and Securing Food. Alright. Pack 8. Another Ino Yamanaka. I guess she's just going to be the first card in all my packs. Uh, followed by Kakashi Hatake. And then a rare Yashi Hyuga. The Neji Hyuga. And Yasharmaru. Ninth pack, and wow, we still got quite a bit of packs in there. First card is going to be. The Demon Brothers Mizu, Akamaru, Naruto Uzumaki, the Hyuga Lineage, and Reason for Their Highest Renown. Pack number 10. Attack from the Blind Spot. Earth style dark swamp. Another rare might guy. Promise from the past. And securing food. Pack 11. First card is Sakura Haruno. Ami. Parasitic Insect Jutsu, Lord of the, of the Land of Wind, and Akane. Twelfth pack. So it seems that these packs, it's usually the third card that is uh, either the rare or uh, the better card in the pack. So uh, Sakura Haruno, Hiyashi Hyuga. And the rare is Haku, the third card. Shadow Possession Jutsu and Akane. Pack 13. Kotetsu Hagne. Choji Akamichi. Puppet Master Jutsu, the Hyuga Lineage, an Unwanted Child. Next pack. Hanabi Hyuga. Ninja Toad. Our rare is Anbu. Lord of the Land of Wind, and Dead Soul Jutsu. Pack 15. Another Ino Yamanaka. Akamaru. Mine Transfer Jutsu. Palm Healing Jutsu and reason for their highest renown. So we've gone through 15 packs, and so far we have seven rares and one super rare. So this will be pack 16. First card is attack from the blind spot. 
the third eye. Our second super rare, Shikamaru Nara. One of my favorite characters. One entrance cost, zero hand cost. Zero, two, zero, zero. Three stars at the bottom, or three dots at the bottom. Here's a closer look at the effect. Gold foil, very nice. That's awesome. Put that to the side real quick. Uh, Kakashi Hatake is the next card, and then Akane. All right, pack 17. Izumo Kamizuki, Gontetsu. Rare is Power for Change. The Guillotine Sword. Gato Transport. Pack 18. Another Izumo. Dreadful Scars. Naruto Uzumaki. Palm Healing Jutsu. And Sand Cocoon. Number 19. Sakura. Hizashi. A rare Koyokyu. Kazahana. Sendayu Osama. And Summoning Jutsu. All right, this is our 20th pack. The Demon Brothers Mizu. The Third Eye. Rare Water Style Liquid Bullets. Lord of the Land of Wind. Chakra Absorption Jutsu. Pack 21. Big Brother. Kakashi Hatsuke. Ken Suchi. Ino Yamanaki. And Tamari. Number 22. First one is going to be Tortoise Ninja, A Thousand Years of Death, another rare Hiyashi Hyuga, Akamaru, and Gato Transport. Pack 22, Koji. Demon Brothers Gozu, Attack Against Weak Spots, Hinata Hyuga, and Unwanted Child. Alright, our 24th pack. So normally in a booster box, this would be the last pack. The first card is going to be Izumo, Gantetsu, a rare Sakura Haruno. The Hyuga Lineage and Tamari. I'm wondering if they put more packs in because of the um, less of a chance of getting a super rare or rares. But anyways, 25th pack. We have Ino Yamanaka, Akamaru, Kuro. Tasteless and Odorless Drug in the Ayashimaru. Pack 26. We have Tauntaun. The Demon Brothers Gozu. Rare 
curse mark out of control. Kenyatta Huga and Water Style Water Dragon Jutsu. Five twenty seven. The Demon Brothers Mizu, Zashi Huga, Kakashi Hatake, Shoji Akamichi, and Shadow Shuriken Jutsu. Next pack. Another Tauntaun, Ninja Toad, our third super rare, Mike Guy, five entrance cost, one hand cost, 6050, here's a closer look at the effect text, very nice, three super rares, <laughs> awesome, put this to the side real quick, uh, we have Sasuke Uchiha, and then Dead Soul Jutsu. On to the 29th pack. Getting closer to the end of these. First one will be Shikamaru Nara. Akamaru. Another rare power for change. Neji Huga. Summoning Jutsu. Pack 30. First card is Attack from the Blind Spot. Gentetsu, Kakashi Hatake, Shared Instinct Assassination Jutsu, and Sand Cocoon. Pack 31. Tortoise Ninja, Thousand Years of Death. A rare gigantic fan water clone jutsu and unwanted child all right the 32nd pack ino yamanaka akamaru kakashi hatake the huga lineage and securing food Still got more. Next pack. The Demon Brothers Mizu. Hizashi Huga. Attack against weak spots. Ino Yamanaka and Yashimaru. Pack 34. Sakura Haruno, Hizashi Huga, Rare Smoke Pellet, Tasteless and Orderless Drug, and Sand Cocoon. Pack 35. Tortoise Ninja, Ninja Toad, Crow. Water Clone Jutsu and Shadow Shuriken Jutsu. And I believe this next one is the last of this specific booster box. 36 packs. So, for the last one, we have Ino Yamanaka, Akamaru, Asuma Saratobi. Lord of the Land of Wind, and Unwanted Child. 
So I have two booster packs left. Uh, I just had these laying around, so I threw them in. Um, one is The Chosen and one is Avengers Wrath. So I'll just start with The Chosen. And now these are gonna be your normal booster packs that are gonna have uh, 10 cards in it and you, know, you automatically have a chance of getting a super rare or a rare. Um, so we have Naruto Uzumaki waiting for the arrival. Uh, a nice foil flower pattern, uh, Naruto Uzumaki. It is a common, but that's still pretty cool. I like the design. Look for the rare Bakuchu, Sasuke Uchiha, Rejection, Ino Yamanaka, Honeyjutsu, Uzumaki Formation, and our rare is 8 trigrams, 64 palms for defense. And for Avengers Wrath. We have Kasuni, the Fire Lord, Hotuaru Katsargari, Gamaru, a Fisherman's Query, Ino Yamanaka Childhood, Kurenai, Naruto Uzumaki Barrage, our rare is Jiraiya, and our holographic is Kanabun. Here's a wrap up of all the notable cards. We had Jiraiya, Anbu, Haku, Might Guy, Yashi, Sakura, Koyuki, Naruto, and Kanabun. Eight Trigram 64 Palms, Silent Jutsu, Killing Jutsu, Fire Style Phoenix Flower Jutsu. Water style liquid bullets, smoke pellet, gigantic fan, power for change, and curse mark out of control. And then our three super rares Might Guy, Gentle Fist style 8 trigram 64 palms, and Shikamaru Nara. So 20 uh, rare or foil cards, and then three super rares. So pretty good. I honestly did not expect to get as many super rares as, as I did from the just original 36 packs. Uh, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, and then I got a lot of pretty cool rare cards um, that I can add to my collection. So I just want to say thank you guys for tuning in for another Naruto CCG video. I'm going to have more videos coming out uh, in the future. Hopefully they'll be a little bit um, more often than the last one, but uh, just keep tuning in for those videos. Like always, stay safe and have a good one.